Hello, we are back. It's been about a week, I think, since I've done anything remotely productive outside of my job. I feel like I was really focused on trying to get back into that routine this week and I just did not do much of what I needed to do. So the goal today is to do everything that I needed to do, specifically relating to this shop update. Okay, maybe not everything, that's a little unrealistic, but at the very least, I would like to get all of my product photos taken today because the weather's really nice and the sun's out, but it's not too overbearing. So I think we have a nice, soft, natural light to work with. And I came up with a great idea. I was originally gonna take photos of them individually, but then I realized sometimes it's better to take product photos in context. So I'm wearing a denim jacket today because we will be pinning them to my denim jacket for the photos. It'll be very simple. And it has a cute strawberry on it already. So, you know, it kind of works out. It's already cute. In case you forgot, there's no way you could have forgotten. It's at the very beginning of this video, but I had some acrylic pins made. So they're super cute, little acrylic pins. They're like enamel pins, but they're acrylic, they're pins. They have pin backs. So we're gonna be pinning them to this jacket and taking photos, which will be really cute. Isn't, isn't this ocean sunfish so cute? Look at that. Adorable. Yeah, I've been slacking off, but it's okay. Um, it's not the end of the world if you take little breaks. So you know what, it's fine. I think some of my new like charms, I'll be taking pictures of outdoors just cause the natural light outdoors is better for charms, I think. And I can capture the glitter and the epoxy resin coating better. But yeah, that's the plan. Gonna take lots of photos going to do my best to edit them. I need to design backing cards, but it's not the most important thing right now. I, it can wait a little longer. And I also need to work on tote bag designs before I can reorder my totes, which I really need to get done because I would love to have them before Mini Mini Con, which is towards the beginning of May. I also need to book a hotel for that. So quite a bit to do tomorrow. I'm hanging out with a friend for a good chunk of the day. So I'm trying to get everything done today, which is, not very smart of me, but you know what? It's okay to procrastinate sometimes as long as you get back on track within a reasonable amount of time, so. All right, we're gonna pin it to the pocket and it's going to be a cute. I think I'm going to start with the frogs, froggy frog. Would this be easier to do if I were to like do it on the table? Yeah, probably, but. It's okay. All right. How oh, cute. Oh, that is cute. I'm gonna go through. I'm trying not to also like, I'm trying not to stab myself. I'm making this so much harder than I need, to, when, than I need it to be. Why am I, why am I doing this standing up? I'm so silly for all the wrong reasons. Okay, okay, it's there. Wow. Pretty cute. Okay. And the last frog I think I have is this big one. So you can go here. And here we are. These are my froggy acrylic pins. 
It looks pretty nice and I like the strawberry. It's a, it's a nice touch because it kind of ties it together, you know, with all the colors. So now I need to actually put this on the table and then take the photos. Also, I dropped a pin back, I think. I think one of my pin bags just fell. So I had my Parasol Waddle Dee charm reprinted with the company I've been using for a while. This is from another um, printer manufacturer. And this one, the one I'm using now, you can't arrange it diagonally to make it bigger. And they just do straight from like top to bottom, I think, for the two inch for this one. So it ended up a bit smaller, so that's why I have to take new photographs of it. It's also in a different material. This one, the old one, has like this star hollow effect and there's no epoxy resin. But honestly, I don't really like the star effect. I think it looks really cheap. But I really like how clear it looks with the resin. I think just the sparkles are enough. I don't think it needs like the cracked star hollow or whatever it's called. So I'm going to take new photographs of this. I also got these reprinted in with epoxy, the glitter epoxy resin around it. So it's bubbly and I fixed the text so it flips properly now. So I'm going to take new photos of these two, which sucks because I really like the original photos I took. But yeah, I think these will be fun to take outside. And I have my giant Rosaria charm I need to take pictures of as well. And she is humongous, but she turned out beautiful, so... And here, my friends, is my delicious lunch. We have some leftover kimchi fried rice that I made last night and I fried an egg. So uh, we're just gonna eat this today and I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna do for dinner. We're gonna have to figure it out later, but I'm so excited to dig in. This is literally the best kimchi fried rice I've ever made. So I'm really excited for this. flowers okay so my uh clump of chrysanthemum that i put into my teacup was a little too big i i knew it was gonna be big but i didn't think it was gonna be this big so i'm gonna make a lot of cups of tea with this but that's good because chrysanthemum is really soothing for me if you've never had it i highly recommend it it's really nice and floral and light not bitter at all and you get to have little flowers. It is annoying to clean though, because the petals get really stuck to like your teapot or your cup. And it's kind of annoying to wash. They get kind of slimy, but it's not a big deal. Since my desk kind of looks like, you know, a mess right now, uh, because I'm working on my shop update, my PC obviously doesn't have room. So I put it on the floor. It's like chilling on the floor right now.
hello hello today we are going to daiso because i really need to buy another storage bin and i can finally store all of my new acrylic products and i will finally reclaim my desk so let's let's go um it took me a really long time to find parking because took me a really long time to find parking because this parking lot is always full. It's like a nightmare to navigate. It's like the worst. I hate it, but we made it. So let's go. Okay, so here's what we're working with. Time to put it all up.
Okay, so this is what I have for my display board. So I'm probably gonna get this printed on maybe um, PVC board maybe, or foam board, not entirely sure. But I feel like this would really elevate my display and it'll be like a really nice and easy way for me to display the acrylic pins. I'm also working on like a price sheet. I don't know, I kind of have it roughly laid out right now. Uh, nothing too crazy so far. I think I'm just gonna have everything neatly organized in here. But I'm planning on placing this order tomorrow before the store I'm ordering from closes shop because they're based in on Etsy and they're going to be participating in the Etsy strike so just want to get this in before that happens but this is what this is what's going on it's turning out pretty nice I like it a lot has my favorite colors and everything. So. Hi, so before I close up the vlog, I wanted to just sit down and chat a bit about some updates and what's going on. I really want to postpone my shop update and wait until my tote bags arrive so I can do everything all at once because I feel like that's easier for me. But also I haven't had a large shop update in a very, very, very long time. It's very long overdue. So that's something I really, really want to do. And in the meantime, I'm working on new stickers that I plan on ordering. So I'm going to have a variety of products. So it'll be the two tote bag restocks, the two new tote bag designs, and then I'm planning on three to five new sticker items. I was thinking a sticker sheet of some kind and then die cut stickers. I also have all the 12, 12 acrylic pins, I believe, and like three new charm designs, acrylic charm designs. So that's what I'm working on right now. The only problem is that my tote bags are kind of in limbo right now. I don't actually know what's going on with them. And my tracking hasn't updated at all past the label created phase, but I talked to my rep and they said that it cleared customs abroad, whatever that means, wherever abroad is, I don't know. But I think it's just a matter of it going through whatever process it needs to go through before it can be um, shipped out to me. And I don't know, I just need UPS to scan the label. It makes me a little nervous, but I, I just hope it updates within the next week or two. If it updates by the end of the week, that'd be great, but I have a feeling it might not update until next week. So right now everything kind of hinges on the delivery of my tote bag. So it's a little nerve wracking, but all I can do is hope that everything works out and that it arrives in time for the con next month because that's happening in about three to four weeks. It's going to be May 7th. It's a Saturday. It's going to be in San Antonio, Texas at the Wonderland Mall of the Americas, I believe. It's a free one day event. It's a free convention you can attend. And I'm going to be vending there. I think I'm going to have a space. It's like a high traffic space I got. And it's going to be somewhere between the venue and the food court, I think. I'm not entirely sure. They don't release the spots until like the actual like placement where you're gonna be until maybe like two days before. So I won't entirely know for sure until then. But yeah, that's the only thing I have coming up right now. Right now I'm just really focused on restocks, getting these products in and just praying that my tote bags arrive okay. And then I also have to take a lot of photos when they arrive. So I'm probably gonna put that off until the next vlog when they do arrive. I'll film myself unboxing, take y'all through like the photographing process and me actually launching the shop update. And I think by the time the tote bags arrive, I'll already have a set day in mind. I also need to plan out my display for the upcoming show. So that'll probably be in the next vlog as well. So the next vlog will be a shop update and Artist Alley vending vlog combined together. So that'll be pretty exciting, I think. I hope it'll be exciting. It sounds exciting to me. Yeah, that's all I have planned. So hope you all have a good weekend, good week, good rest of your month. I don't know when the next time I'm going to upload will be. So I don't know, just have a good life until then, I guess. And I'll see you all next time. Bye.